How you doing everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm sure I've seen this this t-shirt before. Um right. sorry. Um a lot of stuff to go through here today. Right. First of all, this here is a lock. Um it's a chub battleship. Now this here is going out to Chris Capoon now within uh, within the air uh, I'm just showing this here so we can get this out I'm doing a video this year right quick Chris this is smooth as butter mate uh, absolutely smooth um, beautiful beautiful so battleship um, I'm going to show it to him that's what it looks like there on the sides and the back and that's the uh, five keys for it so hey, that there's going to Chris this is an Archub battleship this is my one um, this is probably got for a trade somewhere um it's the same same thing only there's one key in it and it's ever so slightly bent you'll just see it's a wee slightly wee bow one but this will probably go off for a trade because really um and that works as smooth as butter as well no problem so Right, that's the two battleships out of my road. Chub battleships out of my road. Let's keep that one for Chris. Uh, there was another one for Chris. Oh, yes. Um, this here is a German lock. It even says German on the lock on this wee thing here. Um, it says German on it, if you can see it there, but it's clear. Uh, maybe it's too close to it. It says German on it. It's a four lever lock. Um, that's this is the key for it. Looks rightly worn, obviously. This came from Antrim, which is just down the road from me, by the way. Uh, wee bit stiff to turn around. Funny looking wee thing on there. That wee hole there. See the wee hole in the in the shackle there. So I can't really see in down in there. It's a wee bit stiff. Now, it's maybe because of age or what. These two are going up to Chris. So, that's why I want to show them out of my road. Right. I want to show you this baby here. Oh. This is an old style Ingersoll. Um, uh -huh. Came with one key, by the way, and only one key. She's not bad. Ingersoll's are not my really cup of tea, but I'll see what ways this thing go. All right, didn't push them far enough. I never push them in right. Now it obviously comes out. Now the back of it is not in great condition. See that. It's just weak scrapes here and there and things I got there. It's been used. Um, it's a used lock. Uh, it's it works perfect. Just one key. Will I keep it? Probably not. It'll probably go off in a trade somewhere. Um, let's see now. What else have I got here? Oh yes. Um, another Yale. So the one yesterday, or I didn't know, I didn't see one yesterday, I didn't. Um, it's an REL. Uh, how big is it? this thing here? would be... She's 65 mil wide. Um, I think she's three and a half inches tall. I don't know why that shackle is brass or not, I'll tell you now. 
Oh, the keys. The original keys, I believe. Because, oh. That's the keys to there. And that there is just to prove it's original. It says the L on it. It's the proper original key on it. This is a bit... Uh, it's not great. But it's a yell and I don't know why I give that one away or not. I don't know. I'm not too sure. Uh, let's see what else I've got here. All right, this is this is a cheap lock here now. Sterling. This country here, it's it's not deemed as a great lock. Let's see if I can even get this stupid thing at this. I must check. All oh, right, not a bad big kick out. That's not bad. The only reason why I bought it was because it's close shackle, and I think she's sixty mil, fifty mil. I think she should be sixty. All right, sixty mil. She's sixty mil, so that's the only reason why I bought it. Uh, she's alright. Uh, let's see what else I have. Oh, right. These are the ones uh, Daz recommended me to get. I don't know what that is. Is Gary or something? There, she's German make. Now, this is a, a double lock. This here's from a double uh, double pick collection. Um, does he sent me uh, kindly sent me links to a couple of locks, and uh, this was one of them, I believe. I think the way this year's spring loaded. Now these are obviously probably the beginner locks. Uh, because Daz knows that I'm a beginner. And there was another one he sent me. I think. It was this one here. If memory serves me right. Hold on two seconds please. Oh my goodness. I don't know. You're going to have to see it yourselves. I don't know what that says. My. My. I said it's not that great. Um, she is a six pinner. Look, that's the sort of. This is one I believe does told me to get. I think it was, anyway. I'm pretty sure it was. So. Yeah, smooth as butter. So that there, and wait, we'll do one more, and then we'll cut, we'll call it quits. Because I'm sure my time my time's getting up here. This is a defiance. No, it's not a um a chober or squire defiance. It's just it just says defiance, which is I think is copyright. If you hear a banging noise, there's somebody doing a gate next door to me. The only reason why I bought this was because it said defiance on it. Uh, but it's definitely not chub. It's a nice lock. Um, I think she's 50 mil, I believe. And this is the key button on it. Right. I have couple of more locks but I'm not going to do them there today so that's it for the day everybody hey right, everybody um have a great week because it's coming up this is what Thursday and I will talk to you later hey right, bye bye